Pink Fanatic here. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Well, I'm super excited because my furniture is coming in this Friday. So guess what? I get to decorate my office finally and I cannot wait to bring to you guys my office makeover. So let's go shopping. Here's some items from their spring shop. This is real summery uh, home decor and everything in their spring shop is priced 50% off. So as you can see, there's a lot of lemon decor. They got some watermelon dish towels here. They got some really cute stuff here. Well, the items right here, these are also part of their spring shop collection, also 50% off. So they have a lot of black and red items here, which are really cute. farmhouse decor here and also this is considered their spring shop line also at 50% off so they got some really cute stuff here Well, as you can see, it's raining outside and this is all the raindrops on my windshield. I just came out of Hobby Lobby. The lines are huge to check out. So I decided to pass. I'm gonna go over to Marshall's here and see if I can find some Ray Dunn office supplies because uh, I am gonna get my furniture delivered on Friday. So I'm gonna do a little shopping, but let's go over to Marshall's and see what I can find. Well, the rain's coming down just a little bit and I'm getting ready to walk into Marshall's and I'm gonna check to see if I can find some Ray Dunn. But actually what I'm looking for, I want some Ray Dunn office supplies. So let's go inside here and see what I can find. And the rain is starting to pick up. It's been raining here for days now, but i um, curious to see what they have over at this Marshalls in Lakeland. So let's see what I can find. And here's an empty shelf with nothing on it. So this is a lot of this throughout the store. Well, as you can see, there's signs uh, throughout the store on some of their empty shelves. It says, pardon our appearance, fresh new product coming soon. Yes, I may have some hard time finding some office a decor because the stores are really empty. Another empty shelf with nothing on it.
excited to share with you guys what I found shopping because on Monday when I went to Hobby Lobby I was kind of disappointed I went in there looking for a lamp I didn't see any lamps on the shelves at all and the lines were huge they were so long that I decided you know what I do not want to wait in these long lines I am going to skip it and I'll have to do this another day so on Monday I only came across two items and what I was looking for is I'm trying to find some home decor for my office because guess what my furniture is going to be delivered on Friday so I cannot wait to start decorating my office and then next week I'm going to have my bedroom makeover into my farmhouse office I'll have that video up next week so I'm super excited about that but let me share with you a couple items that I found on Monday um, I went into Walmart and I thought, you know what? I can always use another pillow because the sofa table that I'm getting has a bottom shelf. And I always think pillows on a bottom shelf with some greenery always looks really nice. And I thought, you know what? This will look nice with my tan buffalo check drop cloth curtains that I made. And what I like about this pillow, it's reversible. 
And I really love this other side here. So depending on, you know, I just have to play around with it, see which one I want to use, what side I want to use. But this was priced about $12.87. And this is uh, Better Homes and Gardens from Walmart. And then next to TJ Maxx is uh, Burlington. So what happened was on Tuesday, um, we met up with my uncle for his birthday for breakfast in the morning. And the place that we went to across the street was a TJ Maxx. So I thought, you know what, while I'm in the area, there is TJ Maxx, there's a Home Goods and a Marshalls. And I thought, you know what, I cannot leave the area without stopping at the stores to see if there's anything I can find. So I really had some really good luck uh, finding some stuff. Now, Burlington was right next door to uh, TJ Maxx. So I went in there and everything in their store was priced an additional 25% off. So I picked up this little crate. I think it's really cute. I thought, you know what, it's real farmhouse, it's weathered, it's dark brown, it says farm fresh on there, super cute, it was $7.99 and then there was another 25% off, so I got it for around $6. And again, my idea was to turn it on its side, put in some little greenery, decorate the inside, but the only thing that I didn't care about is that the farm fresh is kind of facing this way. Um, be nice if it was turned the other way, but I don't think it's going to work. My other idea was if I didn't like that, then I would use this and take a fake plant of some kind and use this as a, a base and put the plant down inside here, like it's something tall that's already in a pot and then set the pot down inside of this. I thought that would be really cute, but that's an idea I have if I can't use it the other way because I really love this that says Farm Fresh on it. And then the other thing, um, this came from Home Goods, but this was on Monday. So really, I only came home with two things. I came home with this little Ray Dunn item here. I can use this on my office desk. It says, no bad days. I like the saying. I think that's really, you know, perfect for my office. And this is priced at $7.99. And so like I said, Monday, I came home with two things, feeling a little disappointed. But then, like I said, on Tuesday, I was able to hit another Home Goods, TJ Maxx, and Marshalls. So let's go with i think i'll share with you guys what i got at home goods first um let's see another ray dunn item which is perfect for my office is this little organizer here and it says organize so who knows i can put some paper clips in here some other things this was priced 12.99 this is in white and like i said i'm trying to find some stuff for my office to decorate with and then another cute item that's ray dunn was this little spiral notebook here. Uh, this was priced at $7.99. It says write. So if I have any ideas, I can write them down. But I think this is just going to lay right on top of my desk. This is really cute. And then, not for my office, but I couldn't pass up. This little set of hand towels here. There's two of them. It says guest. It's white with the black writing. And these were priced $9.99. And you do get two of them. So I thought these were really cute, and I'll probably use these in my bathroom. And then another cute thing that I've never had these before, this little message board. Um, what I like about this <coughs> is that the letterings, you can put all your own little sayings on these. And they had one that was weathered, like a wood weathered look, like whitewashed. And I really loved that, but it was missing the letters. So of course it wasn't going to work. They didn't have another one. So I ended up just getting the black, which I guess it's going to have to do. I really wanted the other one, but I think this is a cute idea with putting your own little sayings on this little board here. Now this was priced at $9.99 and I think I'll use that on my desk. And then I picked up this little item here. This is also Ray Dunn. Super cute. I love it. Home sweet home with the hooks. <coughs> now my idea is I was gonna I was thinking about using this for my uh, laundry room because I have a wall that has no pictures on it, just a table in front of the wall. And I thought this would be perfect. It could go right above the table. And you know what I love about these? I also picked up the little wreath here. This wreath was priced $12.99. I love the idea of hanging a wreath on the hooks. Now, my question is, uh, could I get away with using this in my office on one of my walls? Or do you think this would probably be better in the uh, laundry room? 
Because um, again, I think home sweet home, I don't know, maybe this should say office or something that would say office for my uh, office that I'm gonna be decorating. But I just love this, so I thought, you know what? If I don't use it in the office, I can certainly use it in my laundry room. So probably in my laundry room, this is where that's gonna go. But this was priced $24.99. So of course, I couldn't pass that up. And that's everything from Home Goods. So I did really good. And then from TJ Maxx, let's see, I picked up this little metal tray. It's got the wooden handles, $9.99, and again, uh, I could use this at the bottom of my shelf on my sofa table and decorate. And it says Magnolia Homes, established 2015. And let's see. Can't have an office without having some Ray Dunn pens. <laughs> These are priced at $7.99. They say write, create, and edit. I thought that was really cute. So I have some pens for my office. And then I picked up some greenery, this little pot here. Uh, this is priced $6.99, and this will go in the office. And then the last thing, I was super excited because I'm sure these were probably put out in the morning sometime because we went to breakfast around 10.30 in the morning, and we were there for, for I don't know, an hour and a half maybe. It, it was a little while. So it was kind of in the afternoon, I headed over to TJ Maxx, and I wouldn't believe, on the shelves, there were six birdhouses. I could not believe it, because I don't often come across birdhouses at all in my area. So when I saw them, I was like, oh, I was super excited, and I'm like, I have to get some of them. Now, I already have the slanted birdhouses, but they all say something different. So I went ahead and picked up the one that says love, it's got the little pink bow on there. And what's really cute on the back are the little tiny birds. And I just get excited finding bird houses because you don't, like I said, I don't come across them very often or really never. So, you know, I thought I have to buy some bird houses. So maybe I can do something in my office with them. And then I picked up this one. It says wild with this bluish teal uh, ribbon. And then on the back, it's got the little feather and their bird houses are priced $19.99. And then I did get another one, which is gonna to go to my daughter-in-law. She wanted this one that says love with the pink bow. Well, be sure to come back next week and check out my video of how I transformed my bedroom into a farmhouse office, because I'm really excited about that. And my furniture will be here on Friday. So until next time, happy decorating.